gratitude, shout aloud, hallelujah. hallelujah. Give Jesus a big hand as we receive our Father, bringing a word of blessing our way this morning. Make that hand bigger for Jesus is worthy of praise. Hallelujah. Lift up those two hands. May this Christmas mark the beginning of a new realm of goodwill in your life. A new realm of peace and joy. A new realm of good news. Between now and the coming Christmas, it shall be good news always. For you and your family, good news always. For you, your children and your grandchildren, good news always. Concerning your health, good news always. Concerning your business and career, good news always. Nothing shall break your joy. Nothing shall frustrate your peace. May every blessing that Christ came to offer begin to find new order of expressions in your life. He obtained for us power. Your life will never be powerless again. He obtained for us riches. You won't miss your place in it. He obtained for us wisdom, strength. Your life will never run short of it. Honor, glory, and blessings. You never lack them again in your life. May everything that Christ offers become a living testimony in your life. Once again, Merry, Merry Christmas to everyone. And it shall be to you the dawning of a new day. It shall be to you the dawning of a new day. As we began to praise the Lord, just showed me something and I want to share that with you. And then we share the goodness. The sorrow of them that hasten after another God shall be multiplied. Watch. You can't manifest the joy of redemption following after another God. That's the undoing of many in our part of the world. The undoing of many is my mom who gave me. It's my grandmommy who gave me. You keep anti-peace item, anti-joy item in your pocket. You can't know joy, you can't know peace. The sorrow of them that hasten after another God shall be multiplied. Ah. And the peace of them that follow only after God shall be multiplied. So make your choice. He said, joy and peace will multiply to you through the knowledge of God. The more of God you know, the more of joy and peace you enjoy. Therefore, every joy breaker, every peace frustrator, I command them off your path from henceforth. <laughs> now listen, never step into 2023 with another God in your house, in your pocket. Never, 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 never. Never subject yourself to professional prophets who prophesy to collect money. It's their trade. Never let God be enough for you. He's enough for me. He's enough for me. Jesus of Nazareth is enough for me. Let him be enough for you. It's our all in all as a commission. We have nothing else we are doing behind the scene. Let Jesus be your all in all. Stop patronizing the devil. Stop patronizing the devil. A double-minded person is unstable in all his ways. Let him not think he shall receive anything from God. Settle with me, God is saying, and say, I will settle your life. Settle with me and I will settle your life. Settle with me and I will settle your life. Set. So when you get home today, anything that you know represents another God, trash them. You have the authority of scripture and you have my authority as your prophet. Trash them. 
they can hurt you. Trust them so they don't trust you. Trust them before they trust you. Trust them before they trust you. Trust them before they trust you. In the name of Jesus. You get a child from the devil, you will be a demon. No, you will be a demon. No one will give back to a demon. Is that one you're getting across to anybody? That thing in your shop, that's why nobody's buying it. You are not selling because you have kept the devil somewhere there who has come to steal, to kill, and to destroy. He can't help you. You can't serve two masters. You have to choose one and despise the other. He just said to me on that seat, he said, tell them, the sorrow of them that hasten after another God shall be multiplied. But today, God has terminated your sorrow. <laughs> Don't go and purchase it. It's gone forever. <laughs> Between now and the next Christmas, it shall be joy unspeakable in your life. <laughs> it shall be peace that passes all knowledge in your life. <laughs> in the name of Jesus Christ. <laughs> shall we together share the goodness of the Lord in fellowship, everybody? Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Would you give it to yourself right now, everybody? Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. Now, give it to your neighbor right now. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow you all the days of your life, and you shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Praise the Lord. Merry, Merry Christmas to someone else around you there with broad smiles, the smile of joy and rejoicing. Glory to God. Keep congratulating people as you go. Congratulating them. Merry Christmas. If you came in after the worship offering, there are officials around the altar and various exits. You can drop your offering as you go and be blessed. If you want to share your testimony in the second service, take your bag, take your Bible, and anything that you came to church with, and rush to the honor entrance, that is the entrance behind where the pastors are seated, and share your testimony to the glory of God. Again, if you want to share your testimony, rush to the honor entrance, that is the entrance behind where the pastors are seated, and share your testimony to the glory of God. The second service starts at 8.10 prompt. 8.10 prompt. 